What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. Today I have a huge announcement and then we're gonna be opening some epic packs. I also have a quick giveaway. I'll be giving away these three original print cards. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed and let me know what you think about the special announcement and let's get right into that. This Saturday, we will be opening all six 2004 Yu-Gi-Oh! tins. Yes, we have done all six 2002 tins, 2003 tins, 2005 tins. Now it's time for the 2004 tins. So we're going to check out all of these. Make sure you guys go check out those old every tin opening videos if you haven't seen them. They're really awesome. And we've had some crazy pulls in them. So go check those out if you haven't seen them. We have all six of the 2004 will be open this Saturday. So yeah, this is going to be a crazy video. I can't wait to show you guys this one. I can't wait to record it, to be honest. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a big video. We haven't done this in a while. I think we did 2005 a couple months ago, maybe three months ago or so. So we're finally getting to 2004. These were a little bit hard to find. Um, you know, when people know you want something, they tend to, you know, try and get more money from you. So I was trying to look for a little bit like an okay deal at least. So I finally did find them. All right, we've got the insect queen. That's pretty nice. This was actually sent in by a fan. Um, well, I bought it for him, but uh, he said he wasn't really trying to sell it, but because he knew it was for this video, he was down. So that's pretty cool. And then we got the Swift Gaia. So all six of these are going to be open this Saturday. So make sure you guys check that out this Saturday. I'm really excited about it. I can't wait to post the video. It's going to be fun. Okay, now we're going to be opening up 33 packs, 10 Stardust Overdrive. We have 20 Duels Revolution and 3 First Edition Legacy of Darkness. So we're going to start off with Cameron S. Got 10 packs off of Ruxin34.com. If you guys want to buy packs to be opened on video or shipped to you, check out Ruxin34.com. I've got a lot of stuff on there right now. So let's go ahead and get into his packs. Hopefully we can pull a Ghost Rare. And I want to mention, guys, you guys remember EX Gamers video the other day. If you guys didn't see the video the other day opening up EX Gamers Ancient Prophecy, he got the last of them. He got the rest of them, guys. So uh, you guys will be seeing his return soon. Okay, let's start this thing off. We got a wolf in sheep's clothing. We got a ritual of grace. Bending destiny. Ooh, right off the bat, reptilian hydra. I think this was a $10 card. I didn't know that the first time we recorded this, um, but it, it definitely is a $10 super rare, which is insane. All right, we got the, okay, Gemini counter. First pack, a super rare that's worth like $10, so not bad. Next pack. Second pack of Stardust Overdrive. We've got Energy Braver. We've got the Insect Neglect. Stygian Dirge. Toon Magician. Earthbound Revival again. That's two of the same rare. Swap Frog is not a bad uh, common. Not super rare. <laughs> common. Okay. Third pack. Here we go. Moray of Greed. Regulus. Toon Magician. Infernity Force. Mother Spider. And Rel Relinquished Spider is missing some of its name. That's a little weird. Okay. And Iron Core Armor. Next pack. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's pull a Ghost Rare, guys. We have yet to pull one. Well, we have pulled one, but it's been a while. Herculean Power. The Jin Ritual. And the Scylla. When was the last Ghost Rare we pulled? I mean, other than the... We did a stream until we pulled a Ghost Rare. So that was the last Ghost Rare we pulled. But before that... I don't remember the last one we did. It's been a while since we've pulled a 5Ds one. I'm trying to think, what 5Ds have we even pulled? Have we pulled one? I think we have, Regulus. Seal of Wickedness, there's a super rare. Um, let me know in the comments, am I forgetting a 5Ds ghost rare? Because we've definitely pulled Zexel and we've pulled GX, because Rainbow Dragon. Um, but I, I can't remember, have we pulled a... 5D's Ghost Rare. I don't know if we have, honestly. I thought we had, but now that I'm thinking about it, I can't think of one. All right, we got a Ritual Buster. Spiritual Forest. Infernity Necromancer. Attack Pheromones. As Zenglong. And Energy Bravery. Okay, so just so far, two foils, two supers. We're looking for, uh, obviously, bigger than this. We're looking for Ghost Rares. We're looking for Seeker Rares, Ultimate Rares, stuff like that. We got a Herculean Power, Stardust Overdrive, Spider Spider, Wolf in Sheep's Clothing. Preparation of Rights. This guy always shows up, but it's like a $5 super, so it's not bad. It's not bad. I think it was $5. I might have, maybe it's a little bit lower now, maybe like 3 or 4 but still a pretty good one to get. Super Rare Unlimited. Spider Egg and the, the Swap Frog again. Not bad. Three packs left. Three supers so far. Let's see if we can get a higher rarity than that. 
Okay, Toon Magician. We've got uh, a lot of more chances at Ghost Rivers. We have the Duelist Revolution coming up. Spider Spider, Ritual Grace, Medusa, Fortune Lady Water, and Iron Core Armor. Okay, Earthbound Wave. <sighs> Two packs for Cameron. Here we go. Here we go. Medusa. Time Passage. Regulus. Oh! Quick Draw Synchron. All right, the Ruxin Special. Time passage. Here we go. Final pack of Stardust Overdrive. Then we can get into the Duelist Revolution and First Edition Legacy of Darkness. We got the Molting Escape, Ground Spider, Savage Coliseum, Toon Magician, Reptilian Poison, and Relinquished Spider. Okay, so three supers out of ten. Not bad, but we're really looking for uh, you know a Ghost Rider, obviously. Next up, we have Julio A. Twenty Duelist Revolution. There are still Duelist Revolution and I believe Stardust Overdrive available on the website. I think Ancient Prophecy sold out. I do have Raging Battle. I have Crimson Crisis. I have these two. So yeah, there's a lot of 5Ds still on there if you guys are interested in that. And if you want to uh, even keep it sealed and shipped to you, we can do that as well. Naturia Mosquito. We got a Beast Rising. Amazon Sage. Scrap Storm. We got a Super Rare right off the bat. He's got the mouse. And <laughs> there's a, literally a mouse in this picture. I never noticed that. A computer mouse, not a, like a, you know, squeaky mouse. Are mice? Oh, I guess they're a little squeaky, but they're also a little nasty. <laughs> on to the next one. Oh, we dropped the pack. Let's keep it going. We, ba we barely hold on to that. It almost went flying. All right, we got a Chain Whirlwind. Lot Sign. Monoceros. Beast Rising again. We got an Amazon's Willpower is not a bad rare. A uh, Pestilence. Isn't that a, uh, isn't that a magic card name? Pretty sure it is. There's my magic uh, tip for the, not tip, uh, mention of the day. Wadmer, Dark Despotier, and Uniform Familiar. Pestilence again. 20 total packs here. So let's see if we can pull something big out of these Duelist Revolution. Obviously, we could pull Effect Veiler Ulti. We could pull Solemn Morning Ulti. Pot of Awesome Secret Rare. The Ghost Rare. Um, that guy. The Ghost Rare. Whatever his name is. Pot of Awesome, by the way, is, uh-oh. Scrap Storm again, what in the world? Pot of Awesome, by the way, is a Pot of Duality. If you guys didn't get the video, if you don't get the reference, I will put the Pot of Awesome video up in the corner so you guys can see the or the origins of that, of that mention. Because it is pretty old at this point. It, it was before we even opened LOB, I think, when I did that. All right, Flamvel Archer, Howl of the Wild, Monoceros, Synchro Fusion, and a Hypnocorn, all right. Hypnocorn is just a weird looking card, to be honest. It's weird. It's real weird. On to the next one. On to the next one. Beast Rising. Got the Amazon of Sage. Pound. Fighting Spirit. And a Luminous Moss. So far, we have two Scrap Storms. That's what we have. Scrap Storm are our pulls for Duelist Revolution. Let's change that. Let's pull something big. Monoceros. Synchro Fusion. Mosquito. Beast Rising. Amazonas Village. And a Battle Instinct. Cool. Another Pestilence. Okay. This is it. This is the time that we break the streak. We've got a Monoceros. we got the Synchro Fusion. Maturia Mosquito. Scrap Yard. Super rare. All right. Lots of scrap. Lots of scrap going on here. We get a Scrap Yard. Not bad. Not bad. Three Scrap cards. we got a Scrap Hunter. That's pretty good. Will we get the... Uh, is this the one with Scrap... Um, scrap something? That's worth like four bucks. That's a rare. Scrap, what is it? Scrap, I can't remember. Mind Mole, we'll figure it out. Watt Cannon, we got a Scrap Goblin. Super Rush Recklessly, we got the Arkansas Razorbacks on here. Look at that. They made it on another card. Check that out. Fourth Super Rare of the opening. So it is Super Rare City out here. This is the superest of all supers. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. But speaking of that special announcement, guys, I am pretty excited to open up all those tins. That's going to be a lot of fun. Flameville Arch, we got the Desperate Tag, Naturia Mosquito. Amazon is Shamanism, super rare central in here. Five super rares out of this one, and what was it, three super rares out of the other one? So we've pulled eight super rares in this opening. Very weird, very weird. A long way to go, though. Can we break the streak of super rares and pull something big? We've got the Psychic over another Desperate Tag, Gen X Worker. Effect Baylor Ultimate Rare! This is a huge pull! I just spit everywhere, but I missed the card, fortunately. <laughs> oh my goodness, I think this is like 175 bucks on TCG Player Unlimited. This is a huge, huge pull. 
Oh my goodness, check that out. A huge pull. Julio A, congrats on this awesome ultimate rare. We broke the streak. Not all supers. We got the Effect Veiler ultimate rare. Oh, that is so good. That is so good. Oh my goodness. Wow. Wow. Congrats on that, man. That's the biggest pull you can get from here. I think it's even more than the Ghost Rare, more than Solemn Warning. Literally the biggest pull. Wow. The best pull from the set. Effect Veiler Ultimate Rare. There's a big debate. Is that or Starlight Max Rarity? I mean, after seeing that, it's pretty tough to argue the Ultimate Rare is not. Desperate Tag. We have the Gen X Worker. Par Super Rare Paradox Fusion. Oh my goodness. This is going to be hype. Julio is, he's not going to be disappointed. That is for sure. Okay, next up, Duelist Ref, Miracle Synchro Fusion, wow, that's a big pull, Howl of the Wild, Howl of the Wild, Howl of the Wild, Playful Possum, okay, Playful Possum, the struggle is real, I cannot speak, what a pull, what a pull, that is so cool, I've never pulled that before, I pulled the Ultra version, that's it, so the ulti is big, Mind Mole, Synchro Fusion, Flame Veil, Desperate Tag, Scrap Golem, that's what I'm talking about. That's a good rare. It's like five bucks, I think. Oh, next pack. Next pack. If we pull like another one of the big three, like Pot of Awesome or uh, Solemn, Solemn Warning, not Strike, that would be great. Oh, and Ruxin Special, right into the super rare. He might, he might get close to 10 foils out of 20. This is crazy. So many super rares. Unicorn Beacon, that's a decent one. I mean, okay, it's probably not decent. The Naturia Beans. Is that our first time seeing it or did I skip over it last time? The Naturia Beans are clutch. That's all I can tell you. All right. Double Cyclone. Mind Mole. Archer. Hypnocorn and the Anti-Magic Prism. Four packs left here and then we go into three first edition Legacy of Darkness packs. It's going to be hard for even Legacy of Darkness to top Effect Veiler Ultimate Rare. It is that good. Oh, no! Ruxin Special. We got the Lightning Tricorn, ultra rare, first of the opening. Okay. Is that the same guy as the unicorn beacon? They're different colors though, so I don't know. Okay, okay. All right, three more packs. <sighs> Secret rare, ghost rare. Let's just top it off with one of those. That'd be okay. I'd be down. Waddle Murr, we got the double cyclone. Mind mole. Amazon is shamanism. <laughs> so many supers. This is insane. We are pulling so many super rares. This is crazy. Light of Destruction. Two more packs. Let's go. Mind Mole. Watt Cannon. Scrap Goblin. Lock Cat. And a Playful Possum. The Elephant. That's a cool looking card. It's funny. It's kind of like a Dumbo's head and that's it. <laughs> Final pack here for D-Rev. It's going to be hard to top what we got here. Scrap Goblin, Lock Cat, Desperate Tag again, and DD Unicorn Knight. Okay, the Naturia Beans, the little toaster bean. Okay, we got to do a quick recap of those 20 packs because we got a great rare. Then we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight super rares, an ultra rare, and of course, wow, 10 out of 20 foils, the best ultimate rare, best card in the set, probably. That's pretty good. Congrats, Julio. Ruxin34.com. Check it out, guys. That's awesome. We got three more LOD first edition packs right here. We are opening these three for Froilatia is what he told me to call them. I hope that's right. First edition. Let's see if we can pull something crazy. We've already had an absolutely insane pull in this video. So can we get an ultra rare super? Whoa, what is going on here? We just ripped the, ripped the, the, the cover art. That's what I'm trying to say. Let's see if we can be careful with the rest of them. All right. Patrician of Darkness. Cool. A faint plan. Love that guy. Smoke grenade of thief. A short print that's still worth a few bucks, but it was worth like 20 bucks for a while. Skull Knight number two. And here we go. Magic Reflector, just a rare. We got the Hunter with Seven Weapons, Lizard Soldier, and Puppet Magic of Darkness. Or something like that. Um, Dark Ruler, not Darkness. Second LOD first edition pack. Oof. Let's see what we can pull. Oh, it keeps ripping like that. I don't know why it keeps ripping like that. All right, I'm trying to be careful, but it's ripping very easily on these. Next pack. 
heart of clear water. Creepy. I mean, just creepy. I just sneezed, but I'm cutting that out. But I'm just letting you guys know. Ominous fortune telling. Mysterious guard. Stamping destruction. And... Bottomless trap hole. A classic rare, but not the droid we are looking for. Final pack. Let's see if we can get something for Floy Floylacia. <laughs> I'm butchering it. All right. Last pack. Let's get him something good. Come on. Let's be careful with this pack if we can. All right. Okay. We did it well that time. Here we go. Let's do this. Super Robo Lady. Troop Dragon. Fang Xing Mirror. Patrician of Darkness. And... Tyrant Dragon Ultimate Rare! Oh my good... Not Ultimate, Ultra Rare, sorry. Oh my goodness! I'm still thinking of that Effect Veiler. What a pull! One of the best Ultras in the set! Wow, okay, it's off-centered. LOD, classic, but look, look! Okay, let's appreciate the card here. Oh my goodness. This guy looks like something to be on Magic the Gathering. I mean, that's our second mention of the day, but doesn't it look like it? That is awesome. Back is very clean. Okay. He's going to be happy because he actually only bought one pack, and then he messaged me and said, uh, hey, what's up? And I was like, dude, I got packs, you know, 20% off for one more day, which was, it's over now, but he, so he got 20% off. He got two more packs, and look what he got. Crazy. Crazy. What a video, guys. What a video. Wow. Some amazing pulls. We have a huge announcement opening those 2004 10s this Saturday. Make sure you guys show up for that one. I hope you guys really enjoyed this one because we had two massive pulls. And that's it for this video. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Dark Monster! <laughs> Shining Abyss. Ooh, the Revival Jam. Oh, and oh!